What you're watching is the initial planning of a terror attack. 18-year-old Matthew King walks past police officers before taking a photo of them and posting it on social media with the caption, Target Acquired. Here he is checking out an army barracks. Prosecutors said he wanted to kill on-duty police or military personnel. He also looked into travelling to Syria to join ISIS. Matthew King had converted to Islam. He'd been in trouble at school and had been expelled. Initially, his behaviour seemed to improve with his new focus on religion. But everything changed when Covid hit and there were national lockdowns. It was during this time when he was isolated that he became radicalised online. It is clear that you are someone who develops an, an entrenched Islamist extremist mindset, extreme anti-Western views, and that you intended to commit terrorist acts both in the UK and overseas. These are some of the items King purchased. He also tried to set up an account needed to buy a knife online. It's tempting to think he didn't pose a lot of danger given that this was a, probably a low sophistication terrorist attack using bladed instruments. However, this was a really serious threat to the public and to colleagues and to the army. And really for me, this was an imminent terrorist attack and we needed to disrupt it. The police received concern calls about King's behaviour, including from his own mother, who was so worried she reported him to the counter-terrorism programme Prevent. And after one of his sinister reconnaissance missions, he was arrested. Although it was King's family who put him on the police's radar, in a letter to the judge, they said they'll always support him. It is thanks to them that his desire to kill never became a reality. Becky Cottrell, Sky News, at the Old Bailey.